present-day church of St. Cuthbert's in Straton in South Ayrshire. It's composed of three portions. It has a Norman-style tower, which dates from actually only 1901. A chancel and a nave that were built on old foundations only date from 1758. Whilst the Chantry Chapel of the Kennedy family of, Be of Blairwan dates from the 13th or 14th century. We do know that John Kennedy converted it solely as the chapel of the Kennedy family in 1475. The Chantry Chapel is where all that remains is the south transept of the original church. The rest of the church seemed to be destroyed by religious zealots at the Reformation. Previous to the Reformation, the church had been part of the properties of Cross Regal Abbey. At the Reformation, a wall was built, dividing the chapel completely separately from the rest of the church, and became the burial place of the Kennedys of Blair Juan. It continued to be the burial place of the Lairds of Blair Juan until 1870. However, in 1758, it was rejoined to the main church, and a, a Laird's loft was built, and also a retiring room. The main church was also the burial place of the Keers of Lochadoon Castle. The original Chantry Chapel had a priest who would day, say daily mass for the souls of the family, in the belief this would speed up their removal from purgatory. However, such belief ceased at the time of the Reformation. In 1901, the chapels returned to its original appearance. The outside stone stairs were removed, with their rather strange Romanesque statues, and apparently had been at the base. The Laird's loft was removed, as was the retiring room. You can still see the blocked-up entrance for the doorway and the blocked-up windows. The retiring room was a place where the Laird could rest, have food, keep warm in front of a fire in between the services. Often there was a squint so they could look down to see when the pulpit was once again occupied by the minister. The priest's door to the chapel was once again opened. Above it there was a niche which may have once held a small statue of St Cuthbert. Beneath the Gothic window, set deep into the stonework, there is a large alcove highly decorated, with the arms of the Kennedys of Blair Juan above it. The two recumbent fig figures present there appear once to have been part of another structure that stood vertically. At the side, there is a holy water stoop. There is a credence table where unconsecrated vessels will be placed. There is a piscina through which the holy water would be poured away and an ormbry which the sacred vessels and the reserved host was kept. On the wall there is a small pedestal upon which possibly a statue of the Virgin Mary once stood. The graves of the lairds of Braouan are now covered by pews. However, on one side of the aisle there is a long stone bench. In times past there was no seating in churches, who either stood or brought a stool. The bench, however, was used by the elderly and infirm, hence the expression that the weakest go to the wall. In the churchyard there are memorials to Thomas McCarthy, who was one of the Covenanter martyrs of the killing times. Later lairds of Blair one were the Hunter Blairs, and on Craigengower Hill there is a memorial to Colonel James Hunter Blair.